Welcome to Tot Time Museum on the Move. My name is Paige and I'm the Family Programs Coordinator at the Harm Museum of Art. Artists capture actions like walking, dancing, and jumping with pencils and paintbrushes. Using colors, lines, and shapes, artists create pictures of people moving and doing different activities. At the Harm Museum of Art, paintings and prints of people dancing are on display. This painting by Kim Unho shows two dancers performing a special Buddhist folk dance called Seng Mu. The dancers wear robes with long sleeves and white hoods and dance to the rhythm of a drum. This dance includes fast arm and foot movements and then moments of stillness. Artist Unho painted the dancers facing each other with their arms raised and feet apart. Try making this pose. What movement do you think comes next in this dance? This print by Mildred Rockley shows two dancers performing the Hota, a Spanish folk dance. The dancers perform music played by the violin, guitar, and other instruments. Like the Sengmo dance, the dancers face each other with their arms spread out and raised, but instead of having moments of stillness, the Hota dancers are active and bounce between dance steps. This dance looks like it would be performed at a party. Where do you like to dance? These prints by Carlos Moreira show dancers performing different dances from Mexico. The dancers wear traditional costumes full of colors and shape. Each dancer has their own special move, like marching and jumping. Do you have a favorite dance move? Now it's your turn. Let's create our own movement-inspired art with paint and our favorite dance moves. You'll need a few supplies to get started. First, you'll need a protective cover for your art-making surface, then a large sheet of paper, a tray or paper plates, washable paint, and paper towels. With paint on our tray or paper plate, we'll then carefully step into our paint to coat our feet. With our feet covered in paint, we'll step onto the paper and dance. Try using different colors for each dance movement to explore what each footprint looks like. Jump, spin, march, and our tiptoe onto the paper to create movement-inspired art. Be careful though, the paint may be slippery. Experiment with mixing colors. Use colors like red, yellow, and blue to mix secondary colors like purple, orange, and green through foot movement. Wash up and then admire your movement-inspired art. 